Hello and welcome to Railway Empires 2. I'm Shadow Coast and welcome to the channel. In this video, we're going to outline what happens when you acquire a company. I haven't actually, a competing company, I haven't actually done this yet. So I thought I'd post a video and we'll find out what happens together. So I'm playing the first tutorial or first main campaign. I finished the tutorial. This is the first main campaign, the Northeast Corridor here. We're going to buy Barty Shiloh's Flamingo Rail. We're competing the Boston Albany Railroad against them. So we're going to buy this. You now own 100% of Flamingo Rail Inc. stock and you will automatically receive all surplus from this company from now on. You have also been granted zero worth of stock and 5.387 million in cash. That's nice. A nice healthy cash bonus. The company is now no longer expanding or participating in auctions. However, existing train lines and station business will continue to optimize. Alternatively, you can dissolve the company at any time through a merger. So we have a choice. We can just make money from them. But we're going to actually merge them because we have this as an optional uh, opportunity here. We need to expand into the, call it, southeast region. So we're going to see what happens when we click this button, merger. By merging with another company, you get their tracks, locomotive stock, region, concessions, and cash. To merge, you need 100% of the shares. You and all the shares of the other company merge now. Yes. All right. So we can keep everything. We can liquidate engines. We can liquidate everything. So to me, I don't see why we get we get zero benefit. All right. The real network of railways. Two 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 hundred and seventy one thousand extra. We're gonna we're gonna keep everything. Oh, four point three million. This makes more sense. We liquidate everything. Down here I didn't see that. We're gonna keep everything for the mission. And now we are the sole proprietor of everything in this region. So that helps. So that is what happens when you uh, acquire a hundred percent of a uh, competing rail stock you have several options you can just let them run and take all their proceeds you can merge with them liquidate everything so everything goes away and rebuild it yourself or you could liquidate just the uh, locomotives which basically means the infrastructure maintains itself and then you can kind of set up the routes you want or you can keep everything which we opted to do here so hopefully you found this video helpful if you did please drop a thumbs up i hope to see you in future videos, Shadow Coast out.